there's seven great wines on the table tonight. There's cheese. Um, but the most important thing is there's nothing that's right or wrong tonight. It's just about having fun, OK? Um, how big is box wine? Um, in the United States, believe it or not, one, every, one out of every six glasses of wine that's consumed is consumed out of a box, OK? You know, I think people don't think of it that way because we think that wine has to have a bottle and a cork or a bottle and a Stelvin. Um, but it really is big, and the biggest wine brand in the world is actually from a box. Um, have a true appreciation for all types of wine. And that's why I was really excited tonight to um, come in and get to talk about box wine, because I think it's one of the most underrated categories in the wine business. So the Pinot Grigio is from a cool climate region. It's right outside of Budapest. Um, this wine was done in uh, stainless steel fermentation. Didn't have any oak. It's very fruit forward. Pinot evil, like hear no evil, see no evil, Pinot evil. Um, <laughs> one of the things that um, I'm actually in charge of at the wine group, I have a great team of brand marketers. And we're coming up with all kinds of new names and new brands. I don't know if you've seen Pinot Evil before in your stores. By not having a cork and a capsule and glass, we're able to pass the savings on to you. And usually the way these things are priced, it's the price of uh, a bottle free. That's about the way that it works out. 